Guys, welcome back to the channel. S here from SNA's Organite Creations. So what this video here is going to be about, um, well, I'm going to talk about these, but um, it's basically about this here. Now, how to clean your copper, okay? So this can apply to any copper um, or any, if you've bought a power pendant, because eventually they're going to tarnish, okay? This does not affect the piece at all. You know, the Organite in there, all the materials that we've got in there, the quartz crystal, it's all going to use, I mean, sorry, work um, accordingly the same Way, okay all it is is it has a bit of a rustic look okay so we'll have a look so this is my uh, personal piece here that I like to wear and um, I love wearing this here cannot recommend it enough to get yourself a, um, a pendant so you're always protected um, I'm wearing one very similar to this right now well it's actually identical to that and I'll show you them in a minute but this one here is brand new I mean like it's been it's been made it's ready to go it's going to get shipped off so we're gonna um, basically chuck that in this bag and then we put it in these padded um, satchel things okay and we ship it off to you right uh, I've got that covered up because you know the addresses and stuff like that <laughs> don't want to give away the people's info so um yeah so what I'm going to do just stick around I'm going to show you how to clean them up so it should turn out like this like it's new and all polished um, but yeah I'll just give you a quick rundown of this now these here I've just put on Etsy okay so if you click the link below don't forget to like and subscribe and uh, but yeah if you click the link below uh, it'll take you to our Etsy shop where you can buy some of our organized stuff um, if you want so as I mentioned like these this here is exactly what I'm wearing now so um, at the front there you've got you know you can clearly see your cell light um, you've got your gold leaf in there you've got your metal shavings you've got um, there's amethyst in there you've got a, a copper coil which is the I call them, uh, it's a Tesla coil, but it's also cut at the royal or sacred cubit length, which um, picks up the vibration or vibrates at the 144 megahertz, bringing more um, beneficial energies your way, okay, for your body um, to protect you as well. Um, does many things in this here, uh, the directional coil, so the energy helps the energy flow, okay. And um, yeah, so on the back as well, we've got the MWO. Okay, now if you don't know much about these, Nikola Tesla himself and George Lukowski come up with this here design. They made this together, and um, this here has beneficial proven effects. Okay, basically it um, can um, have uh, very good effects on damaged cells. So if anything's wrong in your body, we are made up of cells. So if there's a cell out of whack, this here can help mend repair and heal it okay it's beneficial for all things growing plants you know brings about the life force energy it picks it up it is an antenna so it picks up this life force um you know beneficial bio energy whatever you want to call it scalar field scalar waves and uh yeah by all the crystals and everything in it the um powdered materials we use there is almost containing minerals in all of our stuff and um yeah you can get a lot you can get lost in the information basically, but uh, we make really strong stuff, and this is exactly what I'm wearing right now. All right, it's one of these. So these here are available in the shop now. There's two here, they are identical. One is cheaper, and I'll show you why. So if you want one of these, and uh, they're all made, this, they're made the same, these two, you can see it on our shop. But the reason why this one is a lot cheaper is can you see that? Little imperfection there. All right, so it's not going to, it doesn't hurt it at all, it's just in the clear. Um, section of there which seals in that MWO antenna because it's not bare it's embedded within there um, and That's it. All right, so now when you wear this that there's how you wear it at the front So no one's even going to see that But it's much much cheaper price. So if you want a high quality very powerful pendant um, You can go ahead and purchase that one, but these ones here um, These three here are basically plain on the front. You can see how these here are very shiny um, silver you know, and then there's copper in there as well. You can see that um, different layering in there. All right. And now these ones here have just got the copper coil. So it's a directional copper coil. And as I discussed before, um, cut to the specific raw cubit measurements, which vibrates at the 144 megahertz, bringing a lot more healing, beneficial uh, power to it. Okay. Same with this one. All right. It's got your gold leaf. It's got all the goodies in there, okay? It's just made differently. Um, this one here is a little bit different, like it's a little bit different, like it's more black, but it's still slick and shiny. You can see that, right? Um, yeah, but have a look at that. So there's this one, back of this one's MWO with hematite going around. You see all the little pieces of hematite around the other side of that? All right, so a little bit different. And this one here's the hands of hand, okay? So, if you don't know much about the hands of hand, it's basically a uh, protection talisman, okay? Bringing you happiness, 
um, health and good fortune. Um, and it's just yeah, protection. In some faiths, it, um, it is uh, symbolizing the hand of God. Okay, So that's what that is about. It does have your gold leaf in there as well. All the goodies I stated previously. Um, that's just my prints on there. But it's there are they are shiny, smooth, polished. Okay, um, in my opinion, good quality. Um, I put a lot of time, effort, uh, my own frequencies into them when I make them, and all sorts of stuff. Um, uh, fun fact for some some of our stuff: the almost containing mineral we add, which is a liquid. I'm not going to tell you what it is. Um, we do make it, but it's also it's continuously bombarded with. Um, Scalar waves, like we've got a scalar wave generator here. So it's a seven. Oh, hang on. The Schumann resonance, so I think it's a 7.83 hertz, um, is embedded within it. Okay, so the liquid that it's in, the almost containing minerals, um, you can actually program it, and that's in all of our stuff. Okay, so you know you're going to get um, some good healing benefits with our organite. All right, but back to this part. So in order to clean up your copper, your power pendant, um, which you purchased from us, and um, there is a couple of copper cats as well, I'll just say, that are trying to do this little copper coil on the top. And we do make sure that it is going clockwise as well, okay? All right, so it is, it's going to help with that energy production, throwing it out. But uh, there is a couple of people out there that are putting these on there, but they're not doing it right. Like, it's just sliding around on there, and it's useless. These here will not slide anywhere, okay? That's how it is, that's how it looks, and it's fixed there. All right. <laughs> but, um, yeah, copycats. Everyone's going to copy it, everyone in there, but it's the quality that you're looking for. All right. Um, now, simple ingredients, what you need. You've got vinegar, container. Pretty much everyone's got these in home. Um, so what we're going to do is just put a little bit of vinegar in there and just let it soak. And the vinegar is in there, and just like so, you don't have to worry about damaging this or anything like that. You just want to make sure all the metal is in there, okay? So that little uh, copper coil up top is in, is underneath there, all right? And we're just going to let this soak. And we'll leave it, and uh, I'll let you know how long it's, I'll leave it in there for. Like, you can leave it in there for as long as you want. Pretty sure it's not going to do much to it. Um, you know, all it is is going to clean it up, okay? And um, afterwards, I'll show you what you do. But I well, basically, you just want to rinse it off, uh, dry it with paper towel, and you should be good to go. Okay, this is just going to do a light clean because of the the acids in the vinegar are going to clean it. All right, you don't have to swish it. You don't have to do anything. It's very simple. You just leave it in there, and uh, we'll come back and check it out. All right, guys. So we're up to this point here now. It's been about. Oop, I'll just focus. It's been about 10 minutes uh, just soaking in there, okay? So all we're going to do now... Whoop, sorry, 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 sorry. <laughs> Butterfingers. Right, you can see, if you can, maybe where am I, where am I, where am I? I'll show you better afterwards, but it's definitely cleaned it up. It's definitely cleaned it up, all right? So what you're going to do, all you need to do now is just take it out of there, um, leave some vinegar on it, but just get some paper towel and just scrub it, okay? Just, like, wipe it down. You can dip this in the vinegar and, like, just wipe it down to get any excess, um, you know, black stuff off, and you you should see that coming off. All right, so we've done that. There's one final step left, okay? So what you want to do is make sure you rinse this properly, okay? So get all the vinegar off, like put the whole cord under or whatever. Um, it doesn't matter. It's not going to hurt it. And then dry it off properly, okay? So you just want to get all the vinegar off, all the acid, and then we'll have a, a final look at it and uh, see how it went. All right, so this is it, the finished product. You can see this is the one that we cleaned, and if you go... You know, if you go to the front of the video and you can see where it was before and after, there's definitely a big difference there. Now, it's not the same as when you would receive it brand new, um, but it's definitely shinier and, um, yeah, as you can see, okay? So this, keep in mind, this is only 10 minutes in the um, the vinegar. You could leave it for, you know, half hour and you might get a, a lot better result than this, okay? So that is it, guys. This is one way and what I would recommend to do to keep your power pendant clean or any copper for that matter um yeah definitely a good way now like and subscribe check out the etsy shop in the description click the link and uh get yourself some organite thanks for watching